This, my helmet just unlocked the Teleria Triple X. That's right, huge shout out to the website jrm.cc as he's the one who pointed out how to do this on the Teleria forums. But I wanted to make a quick video to show you how to do it as well in case you missed those posts. It's super easy. All you have to do is get some RFID key fobs or in my case, bought some stickers and I ended up sticking one to my helmet because I always ride with the helmet and now I can rest assured that I won't lose the key you know, if I lose my helmet, I have some bigger problems there, but you can program a bunch of RFID key fobs or stickers. Um, I bought these off of Amazon. I'll link them down below, but without further ado, let me show you how to do this. So when you get your Teleria Sting, you'll get two of these keys. These are actually the master keys. So you don't want to lose these because you can program additional key fobs off of this. So all you do is you turn on the bike, Hold the key to it for five seconds. You'll hear that increasing tone. Now that it's in program mode, you can grab one of your additional RFID keys or stickers. Oh, I think I waited too long. So let's try that again. There's the tone and an additional tone, and now this is programmed. So as you can see, I'll turn the bike off, turn it back on, and you hear that tone. Now it's different than this key's tone uh, because that earlier tone lets you know that that's the master key, and then this is off of that master key. So now I have a program sticker, just like I did last night with my helmet, and I can unlock the bike with my helmet as I wear this helmet all the time. And I don't have to worry about losing the master key. Now, again, I had no idea about this until uh, that blog post. And so I'll link that down in the description below so you can read that. He also has an article on some 3D printed stuff that he's done with the Teleria Triple X, as well as adding a remote. Remember when I clipped that brown wire? If you haven't, I'll go ahead and link this video. You clip it and you can reattach it and put it back into that locked mode there. He actually added a remote control so that he can push that button to put his bike back into that locked mode like when you first get it. Again, I'll link that in the description below. I'll link these stickers in the description below as well as some key fobs that I've also ordered. Now it's unclear how many key fobs or IDs can be stored in this bike. It's probably a lot. Uh, but I don't have a specific number there. Um, I guess this information is in the manual, but by reading that blog post or watching this video, it just makes it a lot easier to digest. So wanted to show that to you again, adding additional key fobs to the Teleria Triple X, the RFID. If you found this video useful, hit that thumbs up button, leave a comment down below, let me know what you think. And of course, while you're down there, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Have a great rest of your day.